Hi everyone, welcome to my car. <laughs> so I'm gonna be starting a weekly vlog series just in the month of December, um, because you know a lot of people do vlogmas over December, um, which is where you vlog every single day. Uh, that's not really something that I feel like I can do because honestly I have so many other videos planned in December, so I just feel like I don't have time for it. I thought what I would do is just do a weekly vlog where I kind of show you little snippets of what I've done that week. So today's Monday, December 1st, and um, I'm actually on my way to go work out. And it is absolutely miserable, dreary, cold, awful December weather. You know, in December, like generally, or around the Christmas season, you end up eating a lot more food, you end up indulging with alcohol, and so I think it's really important to like up your game um, as far as exercise goes and to really um, take things up a notch because otherwise you're gonna have the dreaded holiday weight gain after. I'm on my way to my running spot and I think I've kind of underestimated how cold it is today. And usually like I have to give myself a big kick to go out when it's weather like this. It's not so nice anymore like it was in autumn. Um, but afterwards I always feel really really good about myself and I feel like really happy. Oh, it's freezing cold. Okay, so I better get moving. So I've got my awesome Nike running jacket. This one is really good for colder weather and it has a hood also and it's kind of lined so it's um, It's pretty warm <sighs> It feels so good to be outside. The weather doesn't even matter. It's kind of nice and refreshing. <laughs> 36 minutes, 31 seconds. Basically, I ran straight for 36 minutes. I didn't stop and walk. So I'm really proud of myself. So now I think I'm gonna go do some errand running. I will just go with my gross, sweaty ass self, although I'm just gonna quickly <laughs> clean my face off a little bit using a, like a cosmetic wipe which I always have in the car so I'm in my uh, local like grocery store it's actually a huge one I'm just checking out their Christmas stuff here and they have such cute things they look like candy cane Christmas baubles I mean I already have a lot of Christmas decorations from last year so I don't want to buy too much it's kind of hard to resist when you see all these pretty things I'm kind of always drawn to the gold stuff it's really nice it's kind of like an ombre candle and then there's like little See that there's like almost beads or water droplets on? Because I'm doing a big brunch um, this coming weekend, so I'm kind of wanting to buy a few little decor kind of things for the table. There's a home store up here, which I'm gonna go check out. I love like how shopping malls are all decorated for Christmas. So I'm at um, Mikasa now. So this is one of my favorite home stores on Switzerland. It's pink glittery, isn't that cute? I was just like looking at this just gives me so many ideas. I love how this is packaged with this glittery paper. I think I might have to get some of that. Now I'm just doing some grocery shopping in the bottom part and I've just got some yummy vegetables. I'm in the most tempting aisle right now. It's the Christmas chocolate aisle. There, this is all chocolate. This is chocolate here. This is more chocolate here. It continues. Look at this, chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. And it just keeps going. Did you know that Swiss people consume the most amount of chocolate per person per year? Some very typical um, Christmas cookies here in Switzerland. They're called Zimtsterne. I think they also have them in Germany. They're like cinnamon stars. They're really, really good. These ones are from Switzerland, the Basler Fronsli. I think they're chocolate. I don't really like those too much, to be honest. These are Anis Krabberli. So these are made with star anise, I believe. And then these are another really popular um, Swiss cookie variety. They're kind of boring though. I don't really like those so much. And then this is sort of the German-ish stuff. Like you have the um, gingerbread, German gingerbread. Ooh, these are look good. Gewürznüsse. Mm. So these are like with spices. Oh my god. Oh, I want them so bad. But I won't be eating enough stuff this month. So I'm in another store and look, they have the entire Santa outfit. This is kind of what Santa wears here in Europe. Um, he looks a bit different. That's Santa Claus here, European Santa Claus. I have already a Santa hat, I bought one. I feel like this one is so much cooler. Oh, this one's almost too big. 
This is so much a better Santa Claus hat. I just got home and I'll show you the stuff I got for the decor, um, what I bought. So I ended up buying these little, um, what are these called? Like gold spray pine cones. And then I got this big thing of just white and silver Christmas baubles because I'm gonna put that in my bedroom. I'll show you later what I'm gonna do with that. LED lights. And then I got these candles that I showed in that store with that kind of ombre effect and they have this little, so I got two of those and then two of these ones. These have like an ivory sort of color. So I just made um, salad for dinner. So there's spinach leaves in here and then this is kale, which you can almost never buy here in Switzerland, only very, very seasonally at this time of year. One uh, orange in here, slices, and then red cabbage. This is like one of my favorite combinations. I also really like pomegranate seeds on that, um, but we're out of pomegranate right now. And then I just toasted some pumpkin seeds, so I'm putting those on top. Can you hear the crunchy? So the dressing is just olive oil. I use extra virgin olive oil and balsamic vinegar. And then this is a little bit of salt and pepper and then some feta cheese and a little bit of yogurt. That just makes it a bit creamier. And um, I just mix that all up. We just finished watching the last Walking Dead episode and I'm really sad that now Beth died. Well, that was kind of a spoiler if you haven't seen it, but it'll be like a week later. That sucks because she was like friends with Daryl and I liked how their storyline was kind of developing like Daryl and Beth's friendship. I just took um, a nice long shower, got clean, and I was going to do my Christmas decorating now in the kitchen and other places that I wanted to decorate. And now I'm just sitting in front of the computer doing work. <laughs> um, yeah, usually I do actually a lot of my work in the evening. I'm not a very like morning, enthusiastic, creative person. I feel like I get more work done in the evening. I'm in my studio and I'm decorating. Basically, I wanna do the similar decoration like I did last year for holidays, because I really liked it. I've got these ones on a wire. This thing, or this thing I installed like a few weeks ago. Yay, I'm finally done. I hung all my little Christmas balls up. That is gonna be my background, yeah. And the extra lights I just kind of put down here. Um, so it's kind of got a little bit of lights going on there. I think that's fine. Yay, I really like it. It's like 10 past 10. I'm going to give myself a manicure with this um, polish by OPI. This is, do you have this color in Stockholm? And I'm sitting here and I'm watching um, Vikings. Yeah, there I am. I'm pretty beat now. Ready to hit the hay after this. So I'll call it a night and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Good morning, today is December 2nd, so Vlogmas day two, I guess. I wanted to show you, we've got a little um, advent calendar here. <laughs> I know these are for kids, but I love them. And we always had one of these as kids. And I always get the ones with the, just the pictures. I know there's ones with like chocolates. So here is day one. So day one was a little, I don't know what that's supposed to be, a little star, I guess. So today is day two, which is this one, and I can't open this. Day two looks like a little string of food. <laughs> little, I don't know, pastry or something, gingerbread, I don't know. So I'm just making um, a tea right now. This one, it's loose leaf, it's like black tea, and then it has little bits of uh, rose petals in it, and it really tastes like rose tea. It's really good. I got this at a tea store when I was in Germany a while back. So right now I'm just getting ready to talk to Vichy. I'm gonna be working with them um, this month. So they've sent me all these products. Isn't that nuts? So I'm doing like a makeover event with them at in Basel where they've hired me to basically do an event with them where I'm going to be doing makeovers on people. And so um, I really need to get familiar with the products. Yeah, if you wanna come, I'd love to meet you. It's in Basel, so if you have the chance to come, definitely come and um, yeah, <laughs> cause I'd love to meet you guys. I just did my skincare routine, my morning skincare routine, washed my face, brushed my ear. I didn't put any makeup on because I'm just at home. I don't really, I don't put on makeup when I'm at home. I'm just right now sitting doing work. I'm editing um, the video that I plan to upload for today. And I'm also gonna be doing a conference call in about 10 minutes with Vichy. 12th and 13th of December, I am gonna be doing a workshop and a meet and greet slash makeovers on people. 
um, in Basel with Vichy. So I'm going to have a formal announcement later this week, but um, probably by this video goes up, you'll already know about it. But um, yeah, so if you want to come to that, I'll have the information in the info box. So I'm having breakfast slash lunch now. This. Uh, it's just two sunny side up eggs they are underneath this and this is a mixture of spinach and kale. It is about just past 5 p.m. and it's getting dark outside and I've literally been sitting here at the computer all day working. I'm organizing some of the promotional stuff that has to be done for it and probably that is going to go up tomorrow on the blog so I have to actually still do that. And then I was on my blog. I did some stuff on my blog. I had to redesign my press. So here's my blog header and then you click on this thing right here, press, and this is just if you're interested. Um, and then I just revamped it so I put all articles together. So I felt like that's a lot more, you have a much better overview of all the stuff. And it's just um, in chronological order. So there's also video interviews where I was interviewed and stuff like that. But if you're interested in that, you can go and check that out on my website, hellojuliagraph.com. So for dinner, I'm making a big tray bake of vegetables. So these are Brussels sprouts, there's rutabaga, there's, um, uh, what's it called? Parsnips, parsnips, that's the word I'm looking for. So I'm putting that all in, and then I've got some um, bouillon, just some vegetable bouillon. I'm just gonna add that in a little bit. And I'm gonna cook that in the oven. So here are my vegetables straight out of the oven. So I'm just gonna put some fresh parsley. Oh, I have to take off the sticks here. This is fresh thyme from my garden. Balsamic vinegar. And this just kind of gives it a little bit of a zing. So, and sometimes I also like to put in a little bit of um, lemon rind. And there you have your delicious veggies. So that is dinner. We just um, barbecued a chicken leg. Got our setup over here. Whee! Some wine, some candles. Bon appetit! It's 10 o'clock. I'm still working. I finished dinner and then I got right back onto my computer to work. And I still haven't gotten around to decorating. Good night and I will vlog again tomorrow. Good morning. It's December 3rd and I'm going to open up my next. So there it is. There's my picture for today and it's a little gingerbread heart. It looks more like a jack-o'-lantern pumpkin. But anyway, that's for today. I am going to do an insanity DVD right now, um, which is a fitness CD, uh, fitness DVD, core cardio and balance. So I think it's like 45 minutes or something long. The actual um, DVD Insanity is pretty tough. Like it, I like it because it's like short and really, really intense. Like it's a high interval, high intensity interval training, which I like. Okay, so I got my workout in. Quick and intense, 40 minutes, so it wasn't, wasn't that long. But I think that's good for today. So there's protein powder in here, two scoops, um, some frozen strawberries, one whole orange, and there's a little bit of raw oats in here. So I have this like oat mix. So this is like whole oats. There's cinnamon and soy milk and water. Haven't really eaten breakfast, so this will be my breakfast. I just had um, a phone interview with a newspaper that wanted to do, they're writing an article about the death of TV or something like that. So I just did an interview with them and that's gonna come out this Sunday, I believe, in the NZZ um, Zontag. It's a big um, Zurich newspaper and they have a big Sunday, like a big Sunday paper, so it's gonna be out there. Um, and I will definitely put the article up on my blog on the new press section. You can go check it out there. After this, I'm going to start styling my hair because it's looking a little bit ridiculous and hopefully film my video that I wanna do. Uh, yeah, I'm doing Beyonce Haunted there. Oh, she looks so awesome. And yeah, I think I'm gonna do that look because I think it looks so cool. Freaking lip gloss stains not all. This is why I never wear lip gloss. I hate lip gloss, like the really sticky kind because your hair just gets stuck on it and then you have streaks of color all over your cheek. All right, so now I'm gonna film the intro. Make sure my mic is on. And it is, let's see, oh, that's not good, you can see stuff, that's not good. Ah!
Come on. All right. Finally, I'm ready to press record. Hi, everyone. Welcome. Lip gloss. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the look inspired by Beyonce. This is the one that she wore in her new music video, Haunted. Why did I say Haunted so weird? Hi everyone, it's Julia. Welcome to back... Hi everyone, it's Julia. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing Beyonce's look. Card full. Ugh! I have to go find a new card. And it's seven o'clock, so I'm almost done. I just have to film the intro, the giveaway, and do the pictures, but actually that usually takes a while. So I just saw that the intro is a little bit dark, even though on my camera it said that it's fine, but it just looks a little bit dark. So I'm gonna have to reshoot it. <laughs> so it's nine o'clock and uh, I'm finally getting to eat dinner. We're having a TV dinner, we just beat. Both of us are pretty tired. So we're having chicken. Um, this was in that package I bought yesterday. There was four in there. So we had two yesterday, we have two today. So we had that on the barbecue and then just a big spinach salad, there's cabbage in there. And then this is a little bit of the leftover veggies from yesterday. And we're watching, what are we watching, Bjorn? No, oh, not commercial. TLC. They have TLC now. No, it's not TLC. Isn't it's this on TLC? D-Max. Oh, D-Max, it's even worse. It's a channel for men, and they just show bullshit shows. Well, TLC is a channel for women, and they just show <laughs> yeah, bullshit shows. 